understanding how the universe talks back to you. What I've realized is a lot of people are very spiritual in their one-way discussions, right? And so the universe, guys, the universe, God, spirit is responding to your requests. I cannot be more clear. The universe, God and spirit, source energy is responding to what you ask for. We have become so sloppy in our connection to higher power that we have either given our power to spirit and said, here, here, you do, you do it. I'm just going to sit here and, and sit at the front door and wait for my Amazon delivery to, to arrive with my desires. So that's, this is, we've really gotten that bad, right? Where we've, we put it all out and we said, oh God, universe source, help me. I am asking for help. And we literally sit and wait for it. We go, I can't believe I am so faithful and spiritual and I'm asking. And the answer is, is you're sitting waiting for God to use Amazon. <laughs> Which I think is kind of funny because it's not going to happen. And I see this daily with my clients, with client people I meet, whether it's how you pray whether it's how you ask, whether it's how what you believe, what it's become sloppy. It could be you've just become sloppy at doing it or it's non-existent and you don't ask at all. Okay? And you don't ask universe source for help. And so you can see then how spirit unattended or in your unconscious isn't being focused on can create a sense of aloneness. And that's where this aloneness has come up on the planet where if you're a home and then you know, a lot of actually, you know, spiritual truth, um, whether it's religious churches or just showing up in groups or whatever, they've been doing Zoom. But, you know, a lot of elderly, I'm, I'm sure of it, who maybe used to go to an actual facility have been neglecting in that department because I don't think they have the, the sense to get onto a Zoom call or a live call. So this this aloneness is kicking in. So now we're not now we're getting disconnected from people here on the planet, right? So we all got separated out and we all got disconnected and then we're the ones who, you know, if you're someone who's connected to the ones that you don't love that aren't loving you unconditionally. So maybe you have people who, yeah, I have connections, I have people in my house or people my relationships, but at the end of the day, they don't love me unconditionally. And so all this anger inside reveals that it's coming out of everybody. You can see it. A lack of connection, not just a higher source, but also a lack of connection to people. And when you start lacking connection to all versions, of course it's likely to cause stagnation and, 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 and feelings of emptiness. And, and, and it breaks my heart because... There is no one way to connect to source and, and higher being and higher energy and as I call it, spirit. Because spirit is inside of you. And yet we, if you don't do that every day, like you would speak to where we do, where I, when I do couples, you know, coaching and couples retreats, if you don't talk to them every day, what do you expect? Discon disconnection. Well, the same thing goes with source, right? So the same thing goes with source and that emptiness feeling, I don't care what you call it, you can call a rock, you can call a universe, whatever it is. But the feeling of out of control and loneliness, this is what's really cool, is when you learn to reconnect with spirit without the external telling you how to do it, you have your power back. And that's what's really cool. So whether, again, whether it's through prayer, meditation, mantras, um, again, I have, I have truth talk that I teach people to talk into the mirror and they write down what they need to talk about and remind themselves simply just speaking your truth in your mind to spirit, but it's got to have crystal clear clarity. And let me repeat this again. When you are speaking to source energy, higher being energy, whatever it is, without this, you're going to struggle. It needs to have daily discipline, crystal clear clarity. Daily disciplined, crystal clear clar clarity. Your requests to the universe are being heard and being answered with solutions and you're simply just missing the messages. 
And remember that not everyone learns at the same speed, with the same tools, or the same experience. I have an all events page that you can learn at your own pace with videos, tools, my live events, my upcoming TNT coaching, as well as Spiritual Warrior Academy. I'm gonna leave a link down below for the all events page if you're interested. I really hope you enjoyed the video today. If you did, please be sure to go down and give it a thumbs up as well as subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so you get notifications whenever I post a video. I post videos every single weekday on body, mind, spirit topics and tools. There's also more of these affirmations and information on my Instagram. So join me there at IDeserveItNow.com is my website, which I have a ton more tools or I Deserve It Now is where my Instagram is. You can find, follow me on both platforms and or both. I would love to see you. All the links, all my programs are all there for you to enjoy. It's brightest blessings. Have a great day.